always know that. Hey. You got to roll. Here we go. Hey. Tell my baby you the only one I trust I told my shawty you ain't gotta make a fuss When I was down, out of luck, and you stuck It was us in a rut Woke up, I hit a chick for you Baby, give me life, you know I live for you Girl, you know I live for you Ride die, I kill for you Let them talk slick, I'm gonna have to split a wig for you Hey guys, and welcome back to Drop the Mic We're about to get into a little bit of tea today And it has to do with Real Housewives of Potomac. So hit that like button, get settled back in your seat, and let's get into this. Okay, guys, we're going to hop right into it. But before I do that, everything that I say over here is alleged, it's in my opinion, and it's for entertainment purposes only. Listen, there has been a lot of drama surrounding the Real Housewives of Potomac lately, all right? And it's been surrounding Robin Dixon and Juan Dixon, okay? So I don't know exactly uh what made robin do what she did but it has caused mad drama so shout out to media takeout i uh, got this information and article from them i am going to go ahead and give you that commentary really fast and let's get into it so andy cohen reportedly fired robin dixon during a quote heated watch what happens live so Fireworks were blazing on the set of Andy Cohen's top-rated talk show, Watch What Happens Live, which taped last night in New York City. So much fireworks that after the show, Media Takeout has learned that Andy reportedly told Robin that she is fired from the Real Housewives of Potomac. So listen, y'all, this thing gets really deep. So she had like a one-on-one -on -one session with Andy in New York City tonight sunday night is going to be real housewife of potomac's finale episode prior to the reunion and a lot has come out about robin and juan's relationship and juan having some cheating rumors so apparently robin decided that she was not going to share that information on this season of real housewives of potomac instead she went and got a patreon which is a paid platform where you can do videos and spill tea um again it's you there her people that follow her have to pay to get the information that she's putting out so she went to this paid platform and apparently that is where she spilled the tea about wands cheating and and you know the rumors which aren't rumors anymore it's actually true and it's a fact that he was cheating according to robin dixon that did not sit well with Andy. It definitely did not sit well with the Bravo Network. And guess who else it didn't sit well with, guys? Mr. Carlos King. He had a serious issue with this because he felt like, how dare you go get a play platform to spill tea that you should have been spilling on the show that pays you? And you know what, guys? I can't say I disagree with him. I think he's 100% correct. My thing is, is that I'm just wondering again, and I said this in another video, why Carlos is so emotionally attached to the shows that are happening over at Bravo when he has two shows of his own that do pretty well on the own network. Um, the number one show on the own network is Love and Marriage Huntsville, which is happens to be a Kingdom Reign production. And I feel that the same thing that he is accusing Miss Robin Dixon of that he has several cast members that's doing that on Love and Marriage Huntsville. So it's almost like the pot calling the kettle black. So I just you know I don't I I love I would love to understand his why he has so much emotion towards this other show it just doesn't make sense but apparently the answers that 
Robin was giving Andy on Watch What Happens Live were not sitting well with Andy to the point where they got into a heated exchange. So going back to the media takeout um, article, there was a person from the audience that said this was one of the most explosive episodes that they've seen and in, in the show's history okay they say usually andy is really friendly and cordial his uh um, questions are pretty lighthearted, and usually everything ends on a good note with everybody in a great mood and, and laughing but this episode did not end that way they said it was very contentious that they were going back and forth and yeah i think that andy was so much of his feelings that he decided he was firing robin after this exchange so what do you guys think about that because listen this audience member said Andy was not having it that he pretty much read Robin all the way through the interview okay and they said they were sitting in the audience with their mouths hanging open all right and I and after that that Andy was still so much in his feelings that he told Robin you won't be back next season so it's not clear like if Andy has the authority to go ahead and fire Robin but he basically has made it clear that he doesn't want to work with her any longer so what do y'all think do y'all think Andy has the power to hire and fire over there Bravo do y'all think that Robin can go over his head and come back in next season what do y'all think about Robin spilling her tea on Patreon instead of spilling it on the show that pays her and lastly what do y'all think about Carlos King's obvious semi-obsession with Bravo shows and the way they're handling them and not applying his own um applying his applying his own um I guess thoughts and views to the show that he produces what do you guys think about that let me know in the comment section and I'll see you guys in the next video